Hello there. It's been kind of a minute since we talked about slander and people and their hatred of me for some reason. Because I can't necessarily just set the freedom of artistic expression. Because people are sad. But when it comes down to things, before anybody even says anything that might just be in concern of me, I am fine. I do not care about people when it comes to, you know, talking slander. It's basic and it's normal sadly and it's just a fact of life you know so it, it is what it is and the thing is too i obviously could say something completely negative and just be like oh f this person or this person doesn't deserve to live or something like that like i could easily go as far as to go and say some wild shit but at the end of the day i just choose not to mainly because it's a waste of my time at the end of all things do not get me wrong for the people that wants to call it out and point it out and say all this sort of things that it's bad and it shouldn't be a thing that they should be going after me in this sort of way and do that if that's what you would like to do i'm not necessarily mad at it if it's you know brought to my attention and i see it then sure it's interesting i guess to know that there is people that's still out there that hates the shit out of me but at the end of the day, it's not necessarily like the most important thing on the planet, you know? Because this ain't the first damn attack that we had. We had a old boy from back in the day, not too far back in the day, like a few months back really, who was talking like some mad nonsense as well. Still continues to talk mad nonsense, but I don't care. And then you also have, obviously, if you look at my name on Google, if you look through the images, you will see people make memes about when I say lolly is good for your health and then questionable ass people looking at me in sort of way different ways and whatever and it's just like well that is a bad statement even though it's not really that bad of a statement because it's literally just about fictional characters at the end of the day also link will be in the description where we talk about you know the charities to help out actual children but when it comes down to things that is a thing the reddit post was a thing and you know it's still I think up maybe I don't necessarily know I haven't checked it since I done that video there's been plenty of points where people has tried to be negative about me or anything that i'm trying to do and to be fair with you it's by far the least interesting thing that's going on right now it's by far the thing that i do not necessarily have any type of care for in the world at this moment in time because if you notice we have a house that is about to be, you know, in some bad times if nothing is done, right? A little bit of slander means very little in the grand scheme of things when you have this house type of nonsense going on right now, right? And then to add salt into the wound, now a $300 electric bill because why the hell not? Also, what the hell caused that to be a high ass bill, I do not necessarily know. It's never been that damn high before. It's n it's never been that damn high before. So why is it high? I don't necessarily know. Why is it $300? I couldn't necessarily tell you. We haven't done anything different. In fact, I would say this month we probably did less of anything when it comes to electricity. So why is it $300? I don't know. This is the reason why sometimes I just hate money. Because it's just like, why? There's, there's nothing, there's no reason for this. We can't even keep anything that we have because we just put it back into bills or something else. And that's just really the more annoying part. So again, slander, yes, it's annoying. But at the end of the day, I could be in a very much worse position, right? There's plenty of worse things that could honestly go down. Let's hope it doesn't. But at the end of all things, you know, a little bit of slander, who really cares? I'm more concerned about this electric bill and, you know, this house that we're kind of dealing with. But... At the end of things though, I will say that I am very much pleased with the community and how they are conducting themselves essentially. Basically, even with this slander is kind of like, you know, being up my ass in some shape and form and it's not necessarily great. Still, nonetheless, you know, people do care and they don't necessarily want me to go through any more nonsense, which I appreciate because, oh boy, shit has been bad. But when it comes down to things, you know, I definitely do appreciate the support that people have come through genuinely. And to be honest with you, by far, you supporting me is by far the biggest reason why, like, I'm hella motivated to 
get this channel going get it moving in some shape and form and just try my best with whatever we do because honestly without your support i don't necessarily know if i would be as consistent honestly or would want to come up with different ideas honestly or anything of the sort i remember a long 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 time ago where we was in a similar position when it comes to bills and stuff for a little minute where i had to make some videos or you know make some calls to actions in some shape and form talking about that oh by this day we might need some money to do this and do that and no one came through and to be fair i am very new at this moment like i doesn't i don't even have like a thousand subs at that point right i don't even have that i'm barely just getting my foot into the hundreds and it's completely understandable right maybe i had like a few people here and there but outside of that i didn't really get much support not even anybody really commented back in the day now more people is willing to help more people is you know being supportive and it's just something that i'm truly grateful for i don't, the only thing i would say about this whole situation is that i hate this whole situation not just because of what we in the constant stress about it but i hate it because it's just literally me just taking what you can give and then essentially using it for a constant problem that's going to always exist like bills or like you know the mortgage that's on, on the house which hopefully one day will be paid off but when it comes down to things that's the one thing i really would say i hate out of the entire situation because i wish we could like do something different or i could give back in a way but i can't give back because i'm just not in that position to do so which is shitty and it sucks honestly you know and added in anything else that might be added to the situation is definitely not going to be a help at a lot of this stuff honestly so it's just it's just a lot of things going on that kind of sucks right i am a very simple person when it comes down to things okay let's just get this clear all i want in this moment in time is just to have the light bill paid so by wednesday my power doesn't get cut off this mortgage to be handled so i can enjoy myself basically doing what i do like making videos and drawing and going to Fontaine because that's like the thing right now that I'm extremely excited to do and you know have you know and then even on the 22nd of this month Gamescom which I don't know if I'll be reacting to it but I'll definitely watch it and just see what the hell happens right maybe we could talk about it afterwards and when it comes down to things you know I want to talk about that but again the damn 300 electric bill be whooping my ass and there's nothing i can do to pay for at the moment so that's like a you know kick in the dick in many different ways where it shouldn't be you know and like i said before i'm more worried about all the stuff in my personal life outside of you know other things that could be there that shouldn't even be there honestly you know i'm more worried about you know the bills and the mortgage and things of that nature versus someone saying i suck ass i'm the next you know monstrous ugly black guy that has the uh, egregious name and then that ends with four five or four four five or whatever the hell that dumbass name is but when it comes down to things that's not me that's obviously not me in the slightest or really anybody that likes this type of material I, again it's art it's not that deep honestly and if there is something wrong with the art or if there's something wrong with the artist or if there's something wrong in general we know we will get on the ass of that person i don't know how many times we have to just straight up tell you that is the case but we will right so you know all you trying to do is just make a spectacle of things no one cares at the end of the day plus these channels that do this are very low subbed i'm above these channels with the subs thank god when it comes down to things because at the end of everything even when we were talking about you know the main guy that was really trying to get under us essentially try to really bother things i said specifically that once i pass the sub count of what he has i don't want to hear anything about him i don't care to know anything about what he does or what videos he might make on me because he's irrelevant now i beat him i didn't say anything too crazy i actually wish the guy you know good looks and hopefully he'll do you know better things with his channel but he just doesn't and so i said screw it i'll just let the action speak louder than my own words and the action has spoken 
louder than my own words. So, no reason to care about him anymore. But at the end of all things, if anybody take a lesson that is when it comes to this channel and the struggles I've been going through, is that, you know, one, obviously, you might need to, if you're going to be in this content creator game, you might need to have a bit of a hard heart when it comes to this, because people will not care for you, That is especially the people that, you know, will reach out to you, or at least you're trying to reach out to, I should say, excuse me. Like, you know, you try to ask for some help, sometimes that help does not come, and it's very aggravating, especially when you have someone that you know could change your position of things in life and your channel, but just doesn't necessarily do it, so you have to fight it for yourself, and, you know, it's just not necessarily that easy. And then the second thing I would say is just to never really give up, essentially. People, there is people out there that do want to see you succeed in the best of ways and it's very 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 much needed if you're you know in a position like this right so just do your best not to give up and don't let any of the dark or negative thoughts in your head or by someone else coming through and bother you too much because at the end of the day they don't know your struggle they don't know your they don't know your uh you know your pain your suffering or anything like that only you know that right and as long as like you got basically your audience and if you're religious you got god on your side essentially you'll be fine right because i do feel like a, i do feel like a you know shift is actually trying to happen where it will happen when it will happen what why or how i have no absolute idea but i do feel like this channel really is going to start trying to do something i just don't know when where how or what but i need to be patient that's the only thing i can really say when it comes to it right so yeah so don't worry about no slander or anything like that again people that does call it out i appreciate it 100 percent do not get me wrong but obviously don't don't worry about no slander it, it is what it is you know people are gonna talk shit and that's just kind of how people are unfortunately so yeah because like obviously i have like again a 300 dollars electric bill that is more worth my time to think about and try to find some help with is you know or if someone would like to donate that'd be fine to pay that off a little bit and that's more important and the mortgage is more important than someone saying some random shit like let's just be honest but that's essentially all i really have for you for this one right again i do appreciate the support and all i ask for anybody that new come through i honestly ask that you just come through and let's just have a good ass time together honestly respect each other you know be smart about our decisions be wise and essentially that just be it really you know so hopefully you did enjoy if you did be sure to like share subscribe hit the bell notification anywhere else also follow me on the socials and if you like to donate to the channel patreon is available as well and until then it's your boy jay sign off have a blessed day